Hey guys, my name is Kenneth Collins. I'm a transformational coach and I'm doing a series called Real Talk. And what it is, is designed to keep you moving further, faster in your life. Um, today, um, I want to talk to you guys really, really quick about um, the information that's constantly, you know, coming into our lives. We're constantly getting information about every situation that we're faced with, every conversation that we have with anybody, you know, there's information that comes from that. And if we really get present to taking that information and really analyzing the information that we get from people and we get from situations, good or bad, it's going to help us to maneuver through life and be more effective in every aspect of our lives, whether it's relationship, whether it's business, you know, no matter what it is, it's going to help us to be better people and it's going to help us to be more effective in life. You know, people look at life and people look at life like it's such a hard thing, like life is so hard. Well, to be honest with you, life is hard if you say it's hard. And it's not that it's hard in reality. It's hard because you say so. And if you say that life is hard, that means subconsciously you're going to search the universe for everything that proves you right about how you look at life and how you look about everything else. It's all information. Um, I'll give you a good example of, of information. It's almost like when you date somebody for the first time the first couple of words that come out of their mouth is information that's going to help you to be able to determine whether or not this person is going to be good in your life you know i've coached people that have been in relationships and um you know they have been in a relationship for let's say you know six seven months and it's the worst relationship that they've ever had in their entire life well, the thing about it is there was information that was constantly being given at the beginning of that relationship that had they been present to that information, they wouldn't be six months in. They would have known to get out of that relationship, you know, six days in, sometimes six hours in. So I say that to say that, you know, be present to the information that's constantly being given to you. I mean, that's the thing that separates people running into walls, you know, every other every other month or people who are able to kind of navigate through different situations. There's not that many situations in the world um, anyway. I mean, there, there's only a certain amount of situations. I mean, if you can tell me about a situation that nobody else knows about, you know, that that would be something new to me. But there's only so many situations. That's just the way life is. It's not complicated. There's only so many problems in the world. There's only so many situations in the world. And if we just become present to the information that we're getting constantly, it would help us to navigate and to be able to master these problems and these situations that come up in our life. Because if you look at them, they're the same situations. They're the same, they're the same problems. It's like the problems that you have dating one person. If you look at the next person that you date, it's the same problem. It's just different person. But if you are able to be present to the information that the person gave you in the first messed up relationship, it's going to help you to be able to recognize that type of person when they come before you. So to close this off, I just, you know, want for you to be present to the information constantly being given to you every moment about everything and every situation, good or bad. Um, your information generates momentum for your life. By becoming present to the information, it will help you to maneuver, um, maneuver through life more effectively. Do things that are consistent with how you want your life to go, how you want your life to look. Um, sometimes that's going to mean, you know, making, you know, tough choices. It's going to mean you know, giving up certain things that you're used to. It's going to mean giving up certain people that you're used to. But in order for your life to look exactly the way that you want it to look, you're going to have to be able to make the tough choices. If you decide not to make the tough choices in order to have your, your life look the way that you look, that's okay. That's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. But you don't get an opportunity to, to complain about it. If you're not doing whatever it is that you need to do to have your life to look the way that you want to look, it's like be brave, be bold, be inspiring when it comes to you, you know, doing your life. You only get one life. It's like step on the gas, you know, grind in your life, you know, treat your life the way that you treat everybody else's life. This is an opportunity for you to stop putting so much and investing so much in everybody else's life and start to invest in your own life. Um, May the 6th, I have... Um, a seminar coming up called um, Keys to Success. Um, the tickets are twenty dollars. 
uh, we wanted to pass the savings that we've just gotten on to the people that are going to um, be participants in this seminar. Um, for tickets, go to Keys to, Sec Keys to Success 2017.com. You know, um, do something different. I mean, stop doing the same things in your life, hoping for different results. This is an opportunity for you to come and listen to some extremely powerful you know, people in the field of being able to move forward. And um, I will talk to you guys um, next week. You guys have a great day. Have